thought, got to vlog this. It's a momentous moment. The last time I will ever be leaving this building. Yes, freedom. <sighs> yeah, no more work now for like five, six months. It's a weird feeling. I've been in work since I was like 14. But yeah, now I've got to go home, get ready really quickly and uh, head to the airport. diddly everybody so been in Poland now for just over a day got here yesterday uh, yeah gonna just go and film some cinematics gonna be a pretty basic simple day today uh, and yeah I'm just gonna basically get some practice because I haven't really had much practice filming cinematics so I thought you know why not so that was really funny. I was actually just, I did actually just say this inside, but I couldn't say it very loud because there's a child in front of me and I was like, gonna start swearing. So I thought I'd just re-record it outside. But yeah, like the self-scanning machines, like the machines that you have everywhere in the world, like to self-service scanning things, right? I was buying beer and I didn't have my ID. So I was already a little bit, you know, like on edge, because it's like, if they ask for ID, then I've got to put this back and I look like an idiot. But, uh, yeah, so I'm like scanning all my items. Like before I did that, it's like got an option to put it in English, and for some reason, when it's in Polish, it will tell you like one time what to do, to scan the item, put it in the bag in bit, right? And then it shuts up. When you put it in English, for some reason, it thinks you're a moron. <laughs> I scanned the first item and it's like, Please scan your item, scan it. Please put it in the bagging area, put it in the bagging area. Please scan your next item. But no, really? I couldn't have worked that out, scanned it. And it tells you every single time, really, really loudly in English, like what to do. It's like, I may be English, but I'm not fucking retarded. <sighs> okay, I made it back, finally. That was quite amusing. I uh, found, the, found the building fine, which last time was a problem. I ended up going into the wrong door last time with Kasia. This time I went in the wrong, the right door, but I can remember what floor she lived on. So I just spent like three minutes trying to get into the wrong door. And then, yeah, I heard someone from behind the door like, rah, 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 and I was like, sorry. <laughs> Cause I seem to remember yesterday saying she lives on the third floor. This is the second floor. I don't know why I thought that. Anyway, uh, yeah, just been to Carrefour, bought loads of stuff. Didn't get any cinematics done cause it got too dark, but I thought I'd show you what I sort of gathered from from the shop and also tell you the price of it because it's interesting. I don't know why people find shops in different countries interesting, but well. So, I got some lettuce, some sort of protein bar, big ass chocolate bar, Monster, Pepsi, four beers, two craft beers, some burger sauce, hummus, some garlic cheese, and wraps. And all of that came to like, 13 pound 60, I think, if I can remember correctly from the conversion on my phone. That's not bad. What a win. But yeah, I think Cash is still asleep, that's if I haven't woken her up talking. But yeah, I rang her like three times, trying to get in. <laughs> She didn't answer the phone, so she was like, oh, well, if you get stuck, just, just ring the buzzer on downstairs. So I did that, and she didn't answer it. Yeah. Your voice used to keep me warm in the cold of the night. Your touch used to be the color of the truth. was really weird we're like just walking along on the way to get some footage of a church and cash was like there's a food market here i'm like should we check it out she's like oh you know it's just a food market and then we get in there and there's like literally like 
a replica British tea house inside a food market with some really good cake and coffee. So that was like an unexpected surprise of today. <laughs> I mean, come, what the fuck is that? I have no idea. That is like the, the world's biggest fucking padlock. What would you lock with that? Your daughter? I don't know. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Why would you ever need a padlock that big? It's literally got like a hundred padlocks attached to this one giant padlock. Yeah. That's mental. Silly. I have no idea what the fuck that padlock would be used for. Absolutely no idea. Like, I mean, you could lock up the crown jewels with that shit. No one would it's ever like get through a, it. It's a chastity belt. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. What would you lock with it? Your daughter. Like, <laughs> no one would ever get through that shit. Doodly everybody. So today we're heading to a hydrology museum. So this is gonna be really interesting, make some really good footage, so keep watching. Look, it's a shark fish. It's a goldfish that looks like a shark. <laughs> How cute is that? <laughs> right, so we finally arrived here. We're at the hydrology museum. I now have Kasha holding the camera, which is sweet. One less thing, one less thing. Oh, God, you're useless in this right, come on. <laughs> you useless! <laughs> I was like, you're gonna follow me with the camera, and you're like, yeah, 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 and then just, yeah, this is a nice wall. <laughs> possibly find like really ancient species there if you know what I mean yeah. but obviously as we we really don't know that much about oceans like deep yeah. oceans like deep, the thing, deep we know oceans more about space than yeah I know ocean, because we explored more of the space than actually oceans it's on our own planet yeah. oh yeah yeah I know how we can actually just more easily find stuff in, the, in space than I know. the ocean I always found it really it's like, what oh, the fuck? It's heads like see-through and it's got eyes inside that. That's so mental.
bet Subway has to run for their money now. South Sandwich Trench. Do you reckon you can get yourself a, a nice tasty sandwich there? I reckon you can get yourself all kinds of things there. Yeah, like this side. You know this, you can get that fish fried in a sandwich. <laughs> you said I'm not funny. Well, that was funny. <laughs> Time recorded at Ooh. 13 Can I actually touch stuff? 23 January Ooh. 1990. Just touch it. Yeah. Finally! Just touch it. Finally, I can actually touch this. We're on an underwater adventure. That is so cool. We're in the middle of the ocean. Look at all this. this Can we touch this? Oh, cool. You can just touch it. We're in the middle of the ocean. No, I'm just kidding, we're at the, uh, at the museum still, but oh well. That is so cool. You can touch it. <laughs> it's probably the phrase of the day. It is going to be the phrase of the day. Just touch it. But there's a phone there, just in case you want to ring your dad and let us know how you are. No, you can't really ring anyone. Well, that's fucking reasonable. Just because no museum is complete without an ice penis. I want that in my room. I wonder how much it costs to install something like this. Oh. It says there are no two identical snowflakes. Yeah, that's so cool. I really like it. Snow is not white. The white colour we see is light reflected by ice crystals which form snow. Mm-hmm. It's kind of annoying. Last time I came here, and the time after that I came here, my burger had a black bun. Now, it's fucking normal coloured, which is annoying. This is vegan mayo. Oh, I can tell that you don't like it. It has no flavour. It's <laughs> white. Howdy diddly diddly everyone. So, I didn't actually vlog it yesterday before I went and I probably should have done because, you know, that would make a hell of a lot more sense rather than me doing the vlog afterwards. But yesterday I went to a gig here in Wrocław and yeah, like, when we were on the way there, it was like in the middle of an industrial estate. We we're like walking there, we're thinking, this looks a bit sketchy, it's a bit dodgy. And there's like two people also trying to find it who couldn't find it, like, <laughs> trying to find it, and we're like, uh, it's so expensive. And then, um, and then, yeah, so we got there, we're in the, I'm in the queue waiting for some beers, and uh, all of a sudden, like, I just heard an English voice, and I'm like, the guy in front of me was from England, from Oxford, I'm like, okay, didn't expect to see you here, or like, because the site of place it was, it seemed like a very locally kind of place. But yeah, yeah, like actually ended up chatting to somebody who's like English. I was like, how weird. <laughs> yeah, didn't expect that. Yeah, really cool guys. He was from a, I spoke to the whole band, a band called Desert Storm. They're fucking excellent. I'm going to put some clips on, but apologies for the audio because I literally just brought my phone. I wasn't expecting it to be as fucking awesome as it was. Bought their vinyl as well. It's fucking cool. So... Yeah, all in all, amazing night. Came back, I feel very, very sore now, my neck is killing, but, you know.
So where are we? We're at, right, so we're at some park. It's a pretty cool park. There's like a big giant thing there that according to Kasha is a giant penis. That's <laughs> But yeah, like there's just like loads of stuff going on and I have no idea what, what's going on. Just, I don't know. Just random things, but you know, it's good fun. And I bought some thing that's cheesy and I'm going to try it. So. I skate in duck. Hopefully you enjoyed the videos and yeah, basically I'm sort of stopping off here to clean loads of clothes because uh, in two days I'm off to Asia so yeah. I think by the time you see this I will actually already be in Singapore um, but uh, I will upload ideally three videos a week, maybe, maybe a bit more, maybe a bit less, depends on how much editing, how fast the internet is, how much time I have, you know, everything's very fluid at the moment, but I'll try and get the content out there, I'll try and keep it as good quality as possible, hope you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, add the Facebook group, enjoy it. <laughs>